Hey everybody, what's up? Old School NYC Gamer back once again with another pickups video and also a special surprise in the mail that I'm still shocked that I got. So let me just bust into the pickups here. Went to my local flea market guy, which I uh, showed the pickups from last week and I got a really amazing deal on this, so let me just bust into it. To some people it might not be so special, but to me it is because I want to add it to my collection. Now first off, I thought I had this, but I don't. It's 10 yard fight for the NES. And as you can see here, it's part of the sports series. It's also one of the uh, black label cartridges. As you see right there, it's a little worn, but uh, it's not in bad condition. And next off, we have Mock Rider. Now, it was, uh, I remember some of the rental places back in the days to have these cases. And uh, I don't know what the hell this says here. It's uh, all, you know, whatever. But let me just uh, take it out. Uh, cartridge is a little beat up, but it's not too bad. And this, of course, again, is for the uh, Programmable series, which I know I did not have Mock Rider. Next off, uh, I know the Angry Video Game Nerd has done this, and I'm going to maybe try to attempt this, and that is Ninja Gaiden 2. I have the first Ninja Gaiden, sorry, Ninja Gaiden, Ninja Gaiden, Tomato, Tomato, whatever. Uh, it's a little worn right here, a little, little dirty over here, but it seems to be in uh, pretty good condition. Uh, I'm definitely going to give it a little bit more of a cleaning and see if I can get the sucker to work. Next off, we have Gradius, and this is one of my favorite games to play in the arcade back in the day. So I'm really glad to get this for the uh, for the NES. And last but not least, I think one of the best pickups now, of course, this is a uh, Tengen cart. But uh, I know I looked at it, I was like, hey, what game was in this? So when I uh, take it out, let me just uh, without spoiling the surprise here, I found Gauntlet and. Freaking Christ. You can see from the glare there, people, this is like in mint condition. I mean, it's absolutely mint, this cart. And it also came with the manual. So let me just uh, get that. Now, the only problem is with this, I'm going to try to put it under a book or a heavy book, see if I can flatten out the uh, instructions for that. But this is in really excellent condition. I had to see this, though, when I laughed. Uh, uh, do not clean with benzene, paint thinner, Alcohol, if you could see how they misspell that, I mean, really, come on. Or other such solvents. But uh, I thought that was a little funny when they put this with the tank in the cart. And last but not least, I uh, got a package here which says uh, fragile, but I know the post office and the infinite wisdom totally flattened it a bit, which sucks. But I'm still going to uh, take care of this little gift here. Now, this was from a really cool YouTuber, uh, Cynical Enigma. As you see right there, I'm going to leave the link to his channel down there and his annotation over here for the link. If you can see it right there. Okay. So, yeah. So, he uh, PM'd me, said you could send me something, which, you know, he didn't really have to. It was really awesome for him to do it. Uh, just to save time, I opened it up, you know, not to do it uh, you know, off camera to waste time. But uh, from something in here, and I'm, oh, Wow. Holy crap, people. He actually sent me a box copy of Godzilla. Now, notice like I said it was fragile, but of course the post office doesn't listen, so he squished it. But uh, I could get this, you know, in, uh, you know, hopefully similar but uh, decent looking condition. This is actually one of the first box Game Boy games that I even have now to my collection. Because back in the day, you know, when we were kids, we would have it. The first thing we do. You know, we get the game, maybe the, maybe the instructions, and freaking throw it out in the garbage. But, yeah, that's really awesome, John. Thank you so much, man. Uh, yeah, and this is, looks like in very excellent condition, too, just from looking at the game. Let's uh, open it up real fast. Yeah, I mean, it looks really super mint, man. This looks really, really awesome, John. Thank you so much. Yeah, guys, definitely check out John's channel. He does, like, a lot of pickups. He's a really cool YouTuber. And that's about it, everybody, man. So, yet again, thanks, John. And definitely down to my flea market guy down in the Lower East Side for hooking me up with that really good deal. And, by the way, uh, those five games I got for 20 bucks, So, that's definitely not a bad deal at all. As much as I got the uh, flea market guy up where I live, this guy has a, quite a few more uh, rarer Nintendo games, which I want to add to my collection. But, anyway, let me stop chattering, get out of here. Let me head to work, and that's it, everybody. Have a great day, and take care. Cheers.